What's that? What's happening? Trouble. Give it up. The pyramid's surrounded. I'll find out what the trouble is. Watch Dover doesn't pull any tricks. If he does, shoot him in the head, not through the heart. Why does it matter? He'll be dead either way. His heart belongs to Tezcatlipoca. That's not true. We just had dinner a couple of times. Yourself. My finger isn't loaded. Nico, what are you doing here? Firstly, I'm going to set George free, and then screw up Karzak's scheme. No, I can't let you do that. Karzak has promised me power. Raoul, wake up. The only thing Karzak has on offer is death. You may want to ask Oubie, except you can't. Karzak murdered him. You're lying. Oubie is in Europe. Sure, he's in Europe. In London, on a mortuary slab with two bullet holes in him. But Karzak promised. When he frees Tezcatlipoca, we'll all be granted great power. Listen to her, Raoul. Karzak's insane. I, I, I don't know. I, I need to think. You've let your mother do your thinking for you up to now. You need to think for yourself. Your mother and Karzak think alike. There's only one expendable member of the plan left, and that's you. Mother would never betray me. Oh, I'm tired of trying to reason with you, Raoul. Titi Poco. Watch this man, and if he makes a move, shoot him with your gun. your heart out. I think I can guess. We can save the happy reunions for later. We've got to move. Come on! The house of the enemy. Well, we can't stay here like rats in a trap. And we can't go out the way we came in. It would be suicide. I'll have a look round. Maybe there's another way out. In the meantime... Take this. It's the Coyote Stone. It might bring you luck. I hope. You managed to recover the stones from the village? Then we might have a chance after all. Incidentally, what would Titipoco have done if Graciento had moved? Titipoco? Nothing. He's given up violence. Georges? Yeah? There was nothing I wanted to talk to Georges about just then. On the wall was an intricate pattern in blue and gold. By the door was a pattern picked out in blue. The lever was made of stone. There was a large image on the wall of a man in ceremonial garb. More usefully, there were also a couple of levers. Oof! The lever was very difficult to move and appeared to do nothing anyway. Heave! Still no good. George? Yeah? George, I can only pull one lever at a time, and I think we need to pull both together. Okay, I'm up for that. Oh, there's something just 
Jesus Christ! You sacrifice! Where is he? Nico was here with Titipoco. They set him free. I couldn't stop them. You idiot! I should have strangled you at birth. Titipoco's gone soft. He wouldn't have hurt you. I know that. The darkness of this honey is almost upon us, and we have no sacrifice to appease this Catlipoca. Have you any idea what your incompetence will cost us? I think so, and I'm glad. What? The Mayans weren't fools. Tezcatlipoca should stay exactly where they put him. Finally got some backbone from somewhere, huh? Shame it's so late in the day. I'd rather die than see you and Karzak with that devil's power. Fine, we're still a sacrifice show. See, the eclipse begins. Pablo, kill him! This Catlipoca can feed upon his yellow heart. Nico was right all along, but it's still not too late. Come on then, Pablo. Let's see who sacrifices who. What place is this? I was in some sort of strange room. Tiles and dials. The priests who designed this place must have known how to use them. I was going to have to figure it out for myself if I ever wanted to get out of here. The room was dominated by an enormous device, decorated with the usual Mayan motifs. It held two great discs, each covered in glyphs. The tile moved slightly. The tile moved inwards and clicked home. <laughs> 